good everybody it's your boy Ant back with you guys with another specific video for y'all so we're going to check out anime oheads must be stopped by uh ula willow by one of the uh one of my supporters who commented uh to check this check this out and if you haven't seen my other uh reaction video from ula willow with uh togi fushi girl the uh uh ultimate dark skin hater please go ahead and check check that out now when it comes to old heads in anime yeah Old head, when it comes to old people in anime, they take disrespect to a whole different level. Like, you mess with an old folk in anime, trust and believe me, your ass is grass. Because when you you go after uh, old folks, trust and believe me, they will run the fate and they will disrespect you to the point that you have you walked into your own grave. Just to keep it a buck with you. But that's the here and near there. But we're going to go ahead and check this out. Appreciate all the love and support. And if you're new to the channel, make sure you leave a like, comment down below, subscribe, hit the bell notification every time I post. Let's get into this video. Look at this nigga right now. How old do you think he is? Fuck you. Don't even guess. This man is 81 years old. This nigga's abs have abs and those abs have abs. Imagine this guy hitting a granny from the back. He would split Whoa. her in half. Whatever kind of hip she had left is gone now. This nigga dislocated it twice. Oh, That's why all these old dudes in anime never have bitches. Because they killed them 30 years ago. And this dude's probably the weakest on the list. Let's get straight into this. This man is the karate master. Dude is on par with Poe from Kung Fu Panda, and he's 81. Dog, when my grandpa was 81, he was dead. Anyway, so one of his old students was wow. whooping the fuck out of everybody. Dude was smacking this nigga's head off the concrete like he was trying to crack open a coconut. Dude jumped out like he was the protagonist or some shit and gets sent straight to sleep faster than Amazon Prime shipping. Another specific example of why you should not mess with old dudes in anime brought shame upon our dojo nah nigga it was your weak ass that brought shame upon the dojo anyway so the two old niggas find the crime scene and are like oh shit brother we're gonna have to slide for these niggas this man garu is a victim he got jumped by like nine niggas barely survived then he got caught lacking by genos on his one but here comes gramps ready to sneak him in the face with some oh! sweet chin music and then got jumped again by three S tier heroes. And these two old niggas were relentless. They wanted every molecule of smoke. He was like, hey, Geno Sonny, let us handle this young whippersnapper and teach his bitch ass a lesson. He needs to respect his elders more. Like, damn, Unc, oh, this nigga is not ready for whatever kind of lesson you're trying to teach him. He's nope. literally bleeding just trying to move around. Bro is on like two HP. Anyways, they get to boxing, and Unc either don't know what restraint is, or he don't care. Grab this man's nope. arms, hit him with a oh. falcon kick, punch this nigga so hard he did a mid-air spin like it was fucking Looney Tunes. There is no let him get up. He is beating the bricks out of this nigga. Bow, bow, bow. Look at that head movement. What the fuck? This man has zero remorse. He wants this Garu nigga gone. Garu tries running for his life, but then his brother taps in like it was a WWE match. He's like, not too fast there, bro. Oh. Then he's flying into some bug guts. Now you're probably Ew. thinking, these two are some old ass men. They, like after all that movement, their arthritis or back pain's gotta be acting up, right? Like they right. surely gotta take a breather. Yeah. Nah, they resume immediately. Beating this nigga like it's a God of War button match. They beat this man so bad, he got sent into a childhood flashback. Luckily for Garu though, some random ass Pokemon comes out of nowhere to save him. But bro, he would have died right there. He would have got that game over screen and the last thing. Yep, if they went Yo, if, they, if it wasn't for that bird that saved him, trust and believe me, he would have been dead and he would have been six feet under. You would have saw with some old nigga's head swinging side to side. Anyway, so this big ass centipede, literally like, literally the worst creatures that ever fucking exist. Why did God make these big fucking creatures, man? Anyway, so it starts charging at these two old niggas and they both stop it with their bare hands. Dog, Geno's got <laughs> missiles and Tony Stark plasma beams and he couldn't even scratch it. And these Damn. two niggas just gave it the meanest uppercut of their lives. What Damn. kind of pre-workout are these two niggas on, bro? That shit gotta be insane. They keep throwing them bitches. <laughs> and somehow the creature is still breathing. So That's this man crazy. takes off his shirt and just, mm. Mind you, this man is 81 years old looking like this. But before he can send the centipede to a Pop Smoke concert, King shows up and handles it. And that was the weakest unk on the list. Anyway, so these two pull up on Krolo. Niggas just standing there dripped out, looking spiffy. 
He knows he's about to get jumped, but he ain't the type to go out like a bitch, so he's gonna stand his ground. Imagine jumping some random nigga with your 90 year old dad. Both of these niggas are some menaces. They start beating this nigga so bad, the drip literally comes off his body. Dude Damn. had to resort to a knife like he was some type of UKU or some shit. Zeno was <laughs> like, uh, let me show you how we used to slaughter niggas in my day, son. Watch. Bro started oh, casually boy. walking towards him, sends out some big ass Bruce Lee dragon attack, oh. and just starts beating this nigga. No, son, send this nigga to me, Jesus Christ. No. And then Jit in the back unleashes two life deleting balls of absolute oh, destruction ooh. directly into this man. They killed this nigga, like, he's, like there's no way. Okay, well, somehow Krolo barely managed to survive, but bruh, they were gonna jump this man to death. Krolo's crew walks in trying to find out what happened, and Krolo's just like, Nigga, I got jumped in LA by some pussy ass niggas, and they jumped me, nigga. Nobody gave me the faith of a one on one, nigga. Nobody gave me the respect of a one on one, and I painted that nigga when he was on the ground. Pussy ass niggas. The fact Krolo <laughs> managed to survive just shows how high this nigga's drip power level is. We might have to talk about it in another video. Hmm. All right, so fast forward. Xenos is just minding his business on his way home, and this random ass cheetah pulls up trying to test Grank's go go. What the fuck? He was trying to test Gramps. Grant. This shit is a tongue twister. He was trying to test the Grandpa's gangster. Man, he don't know what's about to happen to him. This nigga's dub sounded like some ass. Listen to this shit. I want to test my new ability, and you're right here. Oh my god. He sounds like he's on Dora the Explorer. I'm just like, I really want to go and catch this bingo game, kiddo. Find someone else to play with. And the cheetah motherfucker is like, Not too fast, Grandpa. I really want to beat your ass. Then Gramps is just like, Oh, fine. Big mistake. I guess if you really want me to put you into a pack. Oh, wait, never mind. It seems it's about to be handled. Huh? What are you talking about? <laughs> I'm telling y'all, they only jump. They don't give a fuck if you're a human. A it don't matter who you are. It don't matter if you're human. It don't care if you're an animal. You mess with some old niggas in anime. It's your ass and it's raps. It's GG's at this point bug or a fucking cheetah nigga you can still get murdered they Thanks. don't discriminate for some reason hunter x hunter got a lot of op old heads bro introducing netero unk practiced the same punch over and over and over ten thousand times at this point bro's fist times? itself is a walking black air force did i mention this nigga is 120 years old what? and he's 120 years old and you're doing some shit like that Oh, hell nah, bro. Like, how you are 120 years old and you're doing some crazy moves like that? Oh, hell nah, man. That's messed up. He's literally fighting the bug messiah. Anyway, this man wanted to get straight into action. Bro started distorting time and space with oh. his speed. Started praying to God like, Dear Lord in heaven, please come save this nigga. I'm about to style on his head. He summoned a big ass Buddha, hit the meanest squad ever, and then Quarity chopped the fuck out of him. Bro said hi ya. Merrim ain't no regular ass bug, so this shit not about to be easy for him. Dude did what even Saitama couldn't do, and caught Miram in his bare hands like a bug. But well, remember, this ain't no regular bug he's it's dealing with, not. right? He gonna need some of that extra strength bug spray, some of that raid. Look at dude's <laughs> face, he's like, oh shit, he survived. I'm about to sprain my hip, fuck. So he starts praying again. Lord, whoop this nigga's ass for me, please. And God is answering this man's prayers. Started hitting a Buddha Buddha no badly, sends him through the floor, and then bitch slaps the fuck out of a oh. bug. Look at how he's tumbling across the floor right now. He's getting sent through pillars. Mario eating all this shit like he got a metal plate in his jaw. He rips dog's leg oh! off, bro. Uncle's was like, oh, this ain't nothing. Back in 86, this was a paper cut. And then he just flexes so hard that the bleeding stops. Oh! Then they go full Dragon Ball Z and just start boxing midair. Yep. And Miriam takes off this man's arm. How is this man gonna pray now? Psych, did you niggas forget what this video was about? These old heads are built different. He starts praying with one hand. What? My mom's a devout Christian. I ain't never seen her pull some type of shit like this before. Then his Buddha style. I have never seen nobody pray like that, especially with one arm. Yeah, these old heads, they, they built different. At you grabs mirror him, opens its mouth, and is like, yes. Dude literally prayed his heart out. Got left looking like a stack of chicken bones. Of course, Miram survives though, he's a demon. But this man, Netro, does not go out without a fight. He's like, whoop, I'm out of ideas. Bye, nigga. What the fuck? He killed him. He 
he sacrificed himself. And that's all I got for Dal today, man. I hope y'all enjoyed the video. Hit a like, hit a sub. But wait, don't go yet, bro. What the fuck is going on? We just hit, we're about to hit 20,000 subscribers. That is insane, bro. Y'all niggas are different, bro. I gotta do something, because y'all y'all hitting these milestones faster than I can think of a, a special. But I'm working on a Discord. We're gonna do like a little Q&A or some. Uh, it's gonna be in the description. Thank y'all for watching. Peace. Yeah. <laughs> like I said, them old folks in anime, they are not to be messed with. They are built different. Because especially when you mess with them, you fuck, you fuck around and find out. That's, that's the way how I see it. But if you enjoyed this video so much, comment down below what you guys take from it. And if you don't know who Ula Wallow is, please go check out his videos. They are really, really got top notch. I'll leave his uh, channel link down in the description box. Please show some love and respect to him. Cause, and I want to give a huge shout out to uh, one of my supporters for checking his channel out. It's really, really good. And now I'm going to leave it as, as it is. If you enjoyed this video, comment down below what you guys take from it. I appreciate the time you guys so much. And if you want me to do more uh, video reactions from his channel, Comment down below which one is the best one now reacting. I'll give you a huge shout out for it. I appreciate the time. And if you're new to the channel, make sure you leave a like. Comment down below. Subscribe. Hit the bell notification every time I post. I'll catch you on the next video. This is Chill With It. Signing out.